Now with the arrival of the spring summer collections from our various brands, one thing is for sure, we're gonna be seeing a lot of riding shirts for this summer season. This is an area of the motorcycle clothing world that's really boomed in recent years and brands like Merlin have done really well at advancing this part of the market. So the idea here is not that you have a motorcycle jacket that might be something that you'd wear off the bike. It's literally your normal regular outerwear that you'd be wearing all day, day to day, actually serves as a functional, protective and certified motorcycle garment. And in this case, this is certified to level A for impact and abrasion resistance in accordance with the latest C approval ratings that came into effect in mid 2019. So this is a fundamentally a cotton riding shirt, but this has a DuPont Kevlar lining throughout it on the underside. So DuPont Kevlar is an aramid fiber. This has masses of abrasion resistance and this gives it the abrasion resistance necessary to qualify it in the same way as a motorcycle jacket, in spite of the fact that it looks and feels very much like a regular piece of outerwear would. So Merlin haven't just sort of stopped there. This also comes fitted with D3O LP1 CE Level 1 approved armor that's removable in the elbows and shoulders. You've got the option to upgrade for the D3O Viper armor in the back as well. There's a connection loop by a zipper mechanism and also the actual loop itself. So you can connect this to jeans if you want to in the lower back. So you can create a one piece effect. Some of the other really neat features about the Hendrix shirt that we have here are the fact that you've got these horizontal, sort of hidden YKK zips above the actual chest pockets themselves. And this is great because it's going to allow ventilation. One downside to having an aramid fiber underlayer like the Kevlar that we have here is that it makes it a slightly thicker garment because it's got an extra layer within it. It's not gonna make such a difference that this can't be useful for what it's designed for, but having the vents certainly means that if it does get a little bit hot, it's gonna make a difference and keep you slightly cooler than it would not having them, obviously. You've also got these pockets down here. Now, normally a regular shirt isn't gonna have that, so this maybe gives it away as something that's a little bit more non-fashion related, but a lot of the feedback from guys in the office that do use riding shirts in the spring, summer part of the season is that actually when you are using it and it really is functioning as a jacket, when you get off the bike, you don't have anywhere to put your hands, it's just a little bit frustrating. So this is a nice feature and it's incorporated neatly with a, just a simple opening system. So you just put your hands straight in. And as we said, you can just walk around and it makes it just a little bit more comfortable for regular day-to-day -day use. You have this black overlay collar and also just across the shoulder section on the upper, you have this black patch as well that just breaks up this plaid lining to the majority of the garment itself. This is gonna come in at $179.99, which is a really good value. So compared to the other CE approved riding shirts on the market, as with all things Merlin, this seems to come in slightly cheaper. It's slightly more expensive than something like the Axe shirt they did in previous collections, but bear in mind that was not a CE approved riding garment. So this is, and therefore this jump in price is wholly justified. Branding is minimal by virtue of the Merlin patch here on this left chest pocket. And other than that, you've got simple poppers on this overlay flap which are nice and robust. The way they've been sewn in with this nylon strip down the side of the YKK zip is great because it means they are not going to fail and come out over time. Good quality, easy to access and operate zips, always something we like to see. And as you can see underneath the Kevlar, just visible here slightly under the studio lights, that's the yellow Kevlar there, that layer. And then you just have this very thin sports liner just to make it more comfortable to wear and just to help with moisture regulation on the underside of the garment. Horizontal pocket with a Velcro tab there, just to keep it closed. And something that fit-wise is a little unusual, I have to say Merlin do generally fit bigger than most other brands in the lineup, with the exception of their more recent leathers. Do check out the Stockton in one of our other video reviews. That is a fantastic winning garment for this season. But this one here, I am someone that's six foot two and I have just under a 42 inch chest. And I actually found myself in the medium here with room to spare. So it's designed to be a slightly loose fit. I could probably even get into a small if I wanted it slim fit. So that's slightly odd. So you do need to go and check the size guide and just be sure you're not buying something too big for you. You're probably gonna need to go a size down from what you're expecting. And of course the net effect of this is that if you're someone with more like a 38 to 40 inch chest it is a small chance that even a small is gonna to be too large on you. If you have a bigger chest, you're definitely in luck. Even in the big sizes, this is going to be more than sufficient for your needs. So any comments, questions, feedback, as always, please leave that in the section below and do subscribe to our channel to be the first to find out about the world's finest riding gear. Thank you very much for watching. We'll see you again soon. Goodbye.